I've always had a passion for small business. Not just because I grew up in one with my parents but, and owned them myself, but small business is a lifeblood of every economy. They're the ones that employ the local people. They're the ones who put money back into the soccer club and the jamboree and the girl guide cookies and all the things. They're the people that always spend money to put back into the community. You know, and this, I mean, there's, there's that, which is the future of some businesses. And yeah, I could show you other businesses that are thriving. And it's really your choice. I mean, do you want to be that? Or do you want to be that? And it's all about communication. It's all about getting your offer in front of people in such a way that they get what you do. They care about what you do. They want to support you in all that you do. And yes, we all have to sell. Yes, we all have to make a profit. But we also have to make a difference. And when people see that we're making a difference in the local community, I mean, this is a Trafalgar pub. It's, it's absolutely lovely. I mean, just take it in. It's nothing grand on the outside, but it's full of people buying food, buying beverages, and creating community inside. Sure, you can eat at home. Sure, you can go to a Costa or wherever else, but you can support businesses like the Trafalgar because they've been here a long time and they care and they're investing in this community. That's what business is really about. You supporting low business. Sure, we all get stuff from Amazon. We all get stuff from Staples. That's okay, right? <clears throat> but when it comes down to daily business, these businesses are the lifeblood of who we are and what we're going to be. And if we do not support them 10 years from now, I don't think about it. So let's make sure that we support local business. We shop local, we act local, we spend local, we think local, and we keep local.